What's up, everybody? It's Big John. It's late. It's like um, 3.30 in the morning. I'm done. Gloves are off. Hands have been washed. I've been working on an experiment with um, chemicals, peroxide mix, with steaming, so on and so forth. And I worked on a book that was actually given to me because it had severe liquid damage all the way through the book and I'm going to flash pictures of what I was working with and then the end result. You're going to see some color loss on the yellow, the black line that goes down where the spine is. That was already color loss and that black line was already chipped away. Also you're going to see that one of these staple holes is completely rounded out. That was already done. This cover was not attached, um, only at the bottom. Um, I am not going to restore this book. Um, I'm going to, when I'm done rinsing off the pages and doing all that, I'm going to reassemble the book and just give it back after I press it to the owner of the book. Um, the owner of this book is my friend Neil at my local comic book store of Emerald City and um, he just gave me the book I guess he bought a collection um, maybe five six months ago and they all have the same type of water damage on them okay so the experiment I did was is I took my peroxide mix with a MacuClean and I put those two together and then I wiped the book down stuck it under UV and this particular book, the cover, was under UV for approximately three hours, <coughs> then nine hours, and then 12 hours. So quite a few hours, about 24. So um, it was under there a, quite a while. Um, I put a black cover. I have found out that the light gets more intense on the book if you black it out all the way around it. That way no light can escape and no other light can get in. So it's actually worked much better, stronger um, with the Clean and the peroxide mix. When I put it on the surface of the book, I wiped it down with distilled water and then put my UV lights on there um, just to make sure that there wasn't color loss from the Clean because if you know Amazing Spider-Man 67, the Medusa cover, if you turn that book over, it does have quite a bit of yellow there. I found that there, there was no color loss, and um, there, the brittleness of the cover is very important. I wiped it down after each application of the peroxide and immaculate clean mix. And then, after the first coat, I used my other pump, that just had my peroxide mix in it. And I did not use the Clean anymore. The cover, both sides, the back and the front, on the inside as well, were clean of all the dirt and debris, but it still wasn't that bright white. Okay, so I'm gonna flash um, some pictures on the screen of before and what it looks like now, okay? But for right now, this is Big John. Thank you for watching. And please comment below on uh, what you feel, how everything came out. I would really appreciate that. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you don't like the results. But for right now, I'm out.